Hey guys, it's Joanne here. I hope you are all doing well today. Today I am actually uh, getting ready to head out to go to the Dollar General. I was in the process of getting ready to make some chicken wing dip and realized that I forgot a few things. <laughs> so um, I need to go out and find some shredded cheese and um, a container to actually put the dip in. So I thought I would do like a little shop with me, check out and see what's new at the Dollar General. Um, I really love just walking through the Dollar General store. They usually have a lot of really cool items like in their home decor area. And so, yeah, so come along with me to the Dollar General and let's see what they have to check out. I'm gonna focus today on just hanging out around the home area of my local Dollar General. And I first spotted these really cute vinyl tablecloths I thought were really neat. And then I spotted these uh, Comfort Bay uh, pillows for only $8. And I thought that was a pretty good deal. Uh, looking over through some more of the home items, I noticed they had some six shelf organizers for $6.50 and then some other organization items. Here we have some of that uh, grippy shelf liner stuff. I really need to get some of that for a project I want to do in my kitchen. And of course, we always have um, loads of really good towels. I've purchased these before. You know what? I'm going to grab a couple of these white ones just to have some fresh white towels for my bathroom. I really love the teal color uh, as well, and they did have some gray. It looks like they're a little low in stock in my store. I always like to look around and find other organizing products in the Dollar General and these are those cubes. They only had a couple of different patterns though. Um, I thought they were a little bit more pricey than the Dollar Tree ones. I loved this little fresh flower market tin and check out the assortment of rugs they have. Each of them are about $20 each and they had some really neat colors and patterns. I always like to take a look and see what they have in stock for uh, bed linens. And they had a ton of options for only $20 for a full sheet set, full size, queen size, and king size. Let's take a gander over at some of these pillows. I really liked these soft, fluffy pillows. Uh, these were priced around $10 a piece, but they had quite a variety assortment of uh, designs and uh, fabric. <laughs> uh, I really always loved looking at blankets for the winter time. They had a lot of cozy choices and all the blankets were priced between $12 and $15. They ha always have a really great middle display in my Dollar General. This one was all focused around some of their Halloween decor that they have available. I thought that choo-choo train was really, really cute. And check out that skeleton <laughs> cat. Uh, one of my favorite purchases at the Dollar General is also candles. They always have a ton of candles. They had some that were on clearance. I'm sorry, but 10% off is not clearance Dollar General. Let's just be real. This one I needed to smell because for some reason I was just really curious. And let me tell you, it smelled amazing. And that's Sunset Papaya. They also had a couple of other scents available in those little, con those specific containers. And um, they're really, really cute for, you know, an added decor item uh, to put on display. Now going through all of the different signs and uh, just, 
I don't know, what would you call these things? I, I can only think of like decor items that they had. So many of them. I really liked those flowers down on the bottom shelf, the teal in um, the blue flower wooden uh, signs. Uh, and I, I actually had picked up one of these that says, not the E folks, uh, these, these are banks actually, the rainy day fund. I have one that says adventure fund that I had picked up a few months ago at the Dollar General. But they just have all these cute little decor items that you can put on display in your home. And I thought I would just give you guys a little look at what my Dollar General had as far as their items. I love looking at the basket area. Am I the only one that is just addicted to purchasing baskets and stuff for organizing things? I really liked these uh, weaved baskets. They came in three colors, black, pink, and gray. Big, huge clocks. I'm not a fan of clocks on a wall, to tell you the truth. I'm not going to even bother to look at those. And, of course, we always have coffee mugs and other glass items for your house. Um, honestly, my Dollar Tree really didn't have a big variety, a wide variety of these type of items that you could tell it was their supply was kind of sparse and they actually kind of just tried to spread things out. I did spot some other candles uh, throughout the store and so I figured I would just show you guys these candles. Again there's more of those tins that from the tin that you saw on the other aisle that I was in some hurricane lamps and some flowers. I thought these were really neat, these deco squares. They're made by the Contact Paper Company and they had all different kinds of designs. Um, I'm thinking like purchasing these and maybe even just putting them on poster board for like backgrounds for videos or you could put them maybe in a laundry room if you wanted to spruce up a wall in, in a laundry room but didn't want to really invest in you know real tile um, I'm curious to know if they actually work or not in the clothing aisle they had buy one get one 50% off of blue tagged items blue circle items I absolutely love the hoodies and the pajamas at the Dollar General I think almost all of my pajamas and stuff look at the tie-dye with the tie-dye shorts uh, this feels so comfy cozy uh, they just have so many different cute little patterns like the coffee cups and of course uh, they have a lot of bottoms like sweatpant bottoms that match a lot of the hoodies in the zip up uh, the zip up hoodies that they have at the Dollar General. Um, most of these, however, were all yellow dotted items. So you have to really be careful for the buy one 50% off is only for the blue dotted items, but they just had so many cute little options. Um, I will say this when it comes to the Dollar General clothes, I find I always have to purchase a size up uh, just to make sure that the length in the arms is good for me but just look at the variety of you know these kind of items I love that love sweatshirt in the back with the maroon I may have to come back and pick that one up for sure whoops I'm tearing the place apart here <laughs> yeah nothing wrong with these Dollar General clothes guys take a look at that section the next time you are in the store found a few more items regarding uh, the fall and autumn a uh, lot a lot of little uh, signs and little displays to spruce up your house this fall season I needed to absolutely smell this this is oh it's a woodwick bonus brown sugar and vanilla oh my god guys it smells amazing and Farmer's Market. I didn't smell that one. I don't know why. 
I think I was getting sick of smelling candles at this point. Um, but they did have these little uh, wax melts for a dollar a piece, uh, wide variety of fall scents. And again, more autumn related decor. Enjoy. Looking for some Halloween costumes. Dollar General has a ton of masks and kids' costumes and also Halloween makeup to be able to complete your kids' Halloween look. And I always like to notice this stuff is Dollar General has antibacterial gel, uh, disposable masks, and hand sanitizers. Um, and hand sanitizer spray so that's good uh, I always like love to spend some time in the as seen on TV section now this stuff we all know is kind of overpriced but I always get a chuckle at looking at the different things that they have uh, to sell um, they have the uh, nonstick pan and they have the Flexol. I've always wanted to try the Flexol, have not tried that yet. Uh, I really wanted to focus on this tape. Now, I have used uh, similar tape in my Dollar Tree DIY that I just uploaded, and so heads up, they have that available right at your Dollar General. I might have to pick up a flex tape or flex seal at some point in time. It's good to know that Dollar General has it. And of course, we have school supplies and office supplies, pens, uh, markers, pencils, glue, binders, poster boards, you know, all that kind of stuff for your arts and crafts needs. And I'll just give you guys a little peek. Look at how bare the craft section is at my Dollar General. But they do have some acrylic paints. They had some stickers and embellishments that you can use for your crafting. But honestly, look how sparse my craft area is. It was very, very disappointing. Um, I thought these chalkboards were really cute. We have some canvas, we have some just wood panels to be able to decorate. So always remember, you always have Dollar General to look at when you're looking for some quick supplies. So guys, that is going to be it for my video today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like these type of videos, then please make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. That way you're gonna become notified as to when I upload videos and when I go live on YouTube. You guys be awesome, enjoy the rest of your day, and I'm gonna chat with you in my next video. Bye guys.